Yeah, that, that's, that's my lunch being shaken up. Oh, that was so close. Do a run up. Morning. Welcome to a new week. Doing my jazz workout. Sit up. Oh, here I go. Hang on. I've got to go. I'm there. I'm doing a granny dance. <laughs> So that was a hard workout this morning. It was quite um, hard going, let's say. But I enjoyed it, so did that. And then stripped our bed, changed that. And the little dog decided to throw up over the sofa, over the floor, and then walk in it and go and sit on Poppy's bed and put it all over Poppy's bed so then we had to strip Poppy's bed Poppy had to wash the dog's feet and apparently Mark said she's been sick in the night as well so I don't know if it's her tablets but she's been on them for a week and she's been fine so but look I think she's she's quite snuggly in there now does Poppy want to show yeah. you her brownies so Poppy's made some brownies today they're there they gooey are. as anything aren't they <laughs> Very nice. I should enjoy one of them later. Poppy's off to PQA in a bit. And um, Holly's going as well because Holly's actually left PQA now. Sorry to state of my hair. I've just scrunched it up for doing all the jobs. Yeah, Holly's actually left PQA now because she's 18. But because she left during lockdown, she's allowed to have one last session with one of her best friends, Charlie. So they're going in to have their last session today. So she's coming in a minute to pick Poppy up and take her so I don't have to do the PQA run today, which feels a bit weird. And then this afternoon, I think Mark and I are going to go to Perrywood's Garden Centre for a cup of tea and a piece of cake and... Poppy. Poppy's got panini. And a look round the Christmas stuff and everything. So I will take you with me there. That's if Evie's all right for us to leave. But she's not she didn't eat a dinner yesterday she did eat a chew that we bought her from the shopping trip which you would have seen her run off with and i think that's what she threw up so we just have to keep an eye on that because if the tablets are making her feel poorly then we're gonna have to change the tablets but i'll see how she goes today and tomorrow and then if she's the same i'll have to bring the vets on monday and and speak to the vet well we haven't gone to periwoods because periwoods was full Poplar was full, so we've come here instead to the barn, which is here. So we're going to have some lunch in here, hopefully, if we can get a table. Oh. Right, I've gone for French brie. Mark's gone for chicken Caesar salad to get. Looks different, doesn't it? Good. And we've got some carrot cake to share at the end. Oh, and some crisps. And I've got a cup of tea and Mark's got Diet Coke. So let's get eating. That's me lunch being shaken up. <laughs> Had a nice lunch, as you saw. It was very tasty. I couldn't eat all mine, so I bought half of it. I'm, I'm, um, oh, I'm Mark's eating all his. <laughs> You'll be surprised about. <laughs> but no, it's really nice. But there's not much of a shop there, is there? No, not at all, no. So we're going to head to the range because I need to get some more wardrobe dehumidifiers for Holly, for Holly's room. Um, and we just might have a little look at the Christmas bits. Oh, we'll get something for Mum for tomorrow as well. And um, then go back to Evie to make sure she's not thrown up everywhere even more. Right, update again. We're not going to the range. <laughs> <laughs> the queue was the length of the car park now i'm not being funny but i can no think 
I can think of better things to do on a Saturday rather than queue up like Shop that. It. Yeah. So now we're heading to Tesco's because we're going to my mum's tomorrow for a roast dinner, so I want to get her some flowers. And um, we also need to get some Diet Pepsis because they didn't have them in Aldi's. So it's been a bit of a plan fail, really. I mean, we had a nice lunch, <laughs> but as for trying to look around somewhere, I think you can forget it today. But we are going to go to Tesco's in a minute. But that's probably not worth vlogging, to be honest. Choosing some flowers and and getting some Diet Pepsis. <laughs> <laughs> right, we've got some Halloween bits in Tesco's. What I've seen that I like is, where is it? They've got a nice wreath over there. Some crackers, if you want crackers at your Halloween party. Good. Good morning. Oh, my picture's wonky. I'm just looking at that thinking that's wonky. It's either that or the lampshade's wonky, one or the other. I think the lampshade's wonky actually. Move that out a bit. That's better. It's Sunday today and we are off in a little while to my mum and dad's for a Sunday roast, which will be nice. We're going to play a few games, probably take the dog out. Evie's a lot better today after the sick episode yesterday. I think I told you about that. Oh, I don't know, but anyway. She's uh, she's on Holly's bed at the moment, let me show you. There she is, there's an Evie dog. Are you better today? Yeah. Yeah, she's comfy. And I'm just about to start some craft because I haven't done craft in a long time and I had a few people say, oh, I miss seeing you do your craft. So I thought, oh, I'll, I'll, I'll start doing some. So usually on a Sunday morning is my time when I research the fibro section for the next week. But I did that during the week so I knew that I could clear this morning to do some craft. Now I'll show you what I've laid out. I've literally taken over the table. So this is all my craft stuff so far that I've laid out. These little houses I bought from the works, if you remember, for £2 each. And they pull out and they've got like little drawers inside. And um, I've sprayed them the different colours. This was another little pot that I bought. can't remember how much that was. And um, sprayed it. It's got a bit of a funny pattern on the, the lid there. And I'm just going to add some bits to them to jazz them up. And I was looking at this bronze one and looking at these thinking some of these might be nice on with that bronze one so I might glue gun some of those on I have got other glue this glue that I bought from Wilco's is absolutely rubbish yeah. it just well it did just leak all over everything but it takes so long to dry so if you're gonna get a craft glue I wouldn't get that one the boss stick is good but it goes a bit yellow and this yoohoo is good as well so and I've also got a frame that I'm going to make over for a Christmas present but I can't show you that because they might be watching um, but this is all my bits and pieces I've got all my sharpies there so this is like a box of bits and pieces and then in here I have all my stickers and gems so I thought I might be able to use some of these on the, the little houses as well. So I'm just going to play around with it really and and have a look what I've got. I just saw some that I might... Is it them ones? They're quite nice to use as well. I might put them there. Alice! Hello! <laughs> what are you doing then? What are you going to say to the vlog? She looks half asleep. Probably is. Are you going to go for a walk? Around the garden. <laughs> Around the block. Yeah. Put a harness on. We did actually have a harness for him, didn't we? Yeah, she did that. But <laughs> you got hay on your dress. I know, I saw Bobby's got a nice dress on today for our... Let me show you. Do a bit of a... Look, look at the Crocs with it. Nice. Nice accessory. <laughs> but yeah, she's got her new dress on. This is that, We bought this for Christmas, didn't we? But yeah. we just thought, get as much use out of it as possible. So that was a Primark dress. Yeah. £10. Bargain. Show me the yeah, quickly because I want to get on with craft. Oh, I I Everyone liked you in the vlog last no. week. Oh, thank you. 
<laughs> if you want to send me some macaroni and cheese. <laughs> look. We'll let her have some grass first and then she can run around. Look at her, she looks like a pregnant guinea pig. Fat bum, Alice, <laughs> I know the feeling. <laughs> Triggered. <laughs> What do you think? Did uh, I think that looks really pretty. It's a bit of a glue gun string on there. And get that off. It's the only thing with glue guns is you get the strings. I've just realised why I can't do a lot of craft because it hurts my shoulder. Oh. Arrived at my mum's oh. with flowers. I can smell it. Smell the roast. Here we are. Uh. Hello. Oh look, we've got the conservatory furniture in. <laughs> Mum's standing with the puddings. She's thirsty. There for you. Oh, how lovely. Oh, thank you. I'm so now you've got crazy. puddings and some flowers. Oh, plants. <laughs> Look at that. That's a dinner and a half, isn't it, Pops? Yeah. Polly's got a plate. <laughs> Look at yours. Look at Mark. It's like a mountain. Mountain. Perfect. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I'll get it work. You're not eating a whole apple pie. Just tip the custard on top yeah. of it. <laughs> I'll give it a good. I'll give it a good go. Do you help this? Oh, I'll get a spoon. Chocolate. Oh, oh here you go. Get, oh, okay, get a spoon. Wait, why don't you use my spoon? <laughs> oh, that's all right. Right. What would Green. you like? Uh, Poppy darling. Chocolate. Chocolate. Oh, look at that. Like that? Yeah, that's fine. Thank you. Look at that, Holly. I thought you said you didn't want dessert. Whoa, 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 whoa. That look, is that like just melted <laughs> ice cream? How? Because that looks like melted milk. You like ice cream? It's nice. You try a bit. Do you like that, Poppy? You want ice cream? Yeah, ice cream, please. I made Nanny go out. Look at Lynn. No, but I'm just saying yes, you like that. No, look I don't at want Lynn. Yeah. What about the pie? Do the pie. I've done the pie. Oh, we've done it. Oh, my battery's flashing oh, yeah. there. Oh, nice. Good morning. Look at the state of me. I am going to put some makeup on in a minute because look at the bags today. Look at these. Aren't they lovely? They've got, they've got shopping of their own. <laughs> I've got to be quiet because Poppy's on a, a Zoom call with college. There's my little Evie dogger. Oh, my battery's flashing. I forgot to change that yesterday. So, oh, sorry, Eve. Just caught a walk. Um, you probably saw yesterday we had a lovely day at my mum's. We went for a walk and then it started to pour down, so we came back again. <laughs> we played games, but my battery had died, so I couldn't film any of that for you, I'm afraid. So yeah, I'm going to change this battery now. I've got a few bits and pieces I need to do today and I want to record the fibro section. So that's my plan. It's quite a dreary day, but I like it because it means one, I don't get too hot and two, it's autumnal. Just um, recorded the fibro section with my, my ring light sitting here. <laughs> And I'll show you my setup actually, because I couldn't show you while I was doing it. So there's my ring light, there's Poppy's uh, music stand, and this is the big fan I was talking about. So that's my big one that I use. But yeah, it's worked I think today having this here. Then I can just look to the side so I'm not looking down at anything. So we shall see. 
but I hope you enjoyed that one. Good morning, it's Tuesday. Tuesday, innit? <laughs> innit? Just ready for me jazz workout. Just wanted to show you something that I've made. Um, oh, Poppy's back from a run. Um, Poppy's PQA group. So I made them this hanging heart um, with the pebbles of Ali and Natalie on the front in, in front of their PQA banner. So I'm quite pleased with that. I'm going to give it to them. Well, Poppy can give it to them on Saturday. Yeah, right. That's what I just did. Nice. What did you do? Full two care of our shopping. Wow. Well done. Oh, it's later on on Tuesday and it's still raining wet out here. Just had to put all the rubbish out and luckily there were no frogs under it because if you've all been watching my vlogs you know about frog gate and every time I lift the rubbish up I usually find a frog but not today and Evie's hot on it now. Evie was out there with me like sniffing around going where are they where are they but there weren't any frogs. Probably just phoned me she's uh, been let out of college a bit earlier today so she's catching the bus um, if you wonder why Poppy's at college today and not tomorrow, well she is at college tomorrow, she's doing two days a week now, so that's good. So she does Tuesday afternoons and Wednesday, um, so she'll be there tomorrow as well, but it's not a very nice day to have to come and go and catch the bus, just to walk through town, but she's fine. And, oh I didn't tell you this morning, Evie decided to... Um, throw up and wee on our duvet and bedding so I've had to wash that that's been over there on the radiator trying to dry today and the covers just in the tumble dryer at the moment so hopefully I'll be able to put that back on before we go to bed tonight but that that was really nice of of Evie this morning I thought really kind thing for her to do but um yeah, it's been a bit of a stressful day. Oh, try not to focus on the bra or on the uh, the washing. <laughs> yeah, we've had a bit of a disaster because, as you know, Holly has chronic migraine syndrome, and she has quite a lot of medication for that. And the hospital that she's under um, prescribed the medication, but she she was running out of the medication so she asked the doctors to re-prescribe it and they said they wouldn't even though they're the ones that did the prescription in the first place oh it's been so stressful so she's been off of her medication for like a couple of weeks now because they haven't been able to get it to her and she's had two blackout episodes at college so she's not allowed to do college until she's got this under control obviously for safety reasons so it's been a lot of trying to find the hospital, trying to find the doctors, trying to get her medication sorted somehow. I don't know. I've spoken to the hospital today. They're going to find the doctors, but I still don't know. It's like, why is it so difficult just to be able to get your medication? I mean, it's so bad that she hasn't had it for a fortnight because they can't get their arse into gear to actually get it prescribed for her. They just keep coming up with excuses all the time. But anyway... That's been my stressful Tuesday. <laughs> Afternoon. Wouldn't be the same coming on here without seeing me sorting my fringe out, would it? I have, in fairness to me, just been out for a walk with Evie, so that'll be why I'm sorting myself out. I'm walking and talking, if that's all right. I'm just checking to see if Poppy's got any washing, because uh, I'm just putting some washing on. Yes, she has, by the looks of it. What a surprise. Um, yeah, so I've just taken Eve out. I did a jazz, another jazz workouts one, because usually, for those of you that remember, on a Wednesday is usually my seated yoga class. But there was a bit of kerfuffle with that this week, because you have to pay and book online now, which I thought I did. I'm trying to pick up these clothes with one hand and it's not working. But... I never got, hang on, oh for goodness sake, I keep dropping everything, <laughs> major close up, <laughs> I'm just trying to hold all the washing so I don't have to keep going back and forth, right let me just check I've got all that, have I got all that, out of breath, so bad isn't it, 
Oh, you think I'd be fit? You know, all the jazz workouts I do. Anyway, oh, who else? Who else, right? Does it drive you nuts if you get a sock that's inside out? All the Poppy socks are inside out, and I know she'll be watching this. So Poppy Lord, put your friggin' socks the right way round. <laughs> that's all I ask. Anyway. Yeah, so, yeah, I was booking, I was talking to you about booking thingy online, wasn't I? Um, so I thought I did it all, but I didn't get the email confirmation come through. So I messaged Lee, who runs our classes, and she said, well, you're not on my list, and the class is full now. So I'm like, great. Because <sighs> I do like my yoga session, because I haven't been for two weeks, because the first week I was ill... And then the second week I had to look after Evie. Let me put you down a minute while I... So I haven't been for two weeks. I've still been exercising, but just not doing yoga. So I couldn't do yoga again this week because it didn't go through. Because the class was fully booked. Now, to say I was disappointed a little bit, but at the same time, I thought, well, I'll just do another jazzercise because she does a jazzercise... Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday morning, so I thought I'd just do another jazzercise, which I did. But I was also thinking about it, and now the seated yoga class I go to is mainly old people. There isn't anyone, anyone my age, apart from the instructor. And I just feel sometimes that it's not enough. And But the actual yoga classes on the mats, are too much because I've tried one here myself and it's too much so I don't know really whether to go back to yoga because I know it's so good for your mind and body yoga or whether to just carry on doing jazz at home jazz is very good for you as well because it works all your body and strengthens and you know does all all that shiz but I don't know I don't know what to do anymore really. I haven't rushed to book the next class of yoga, let's put it that way. And now I'm paying for jazz, I'm like, well do I really want to be paying £30 a month for jazz and then £8 a week for yoga as well? I mean that's quite a lot to spend on exercise. I think Holly's home. So I think, that's the washing machine by the way. Is it? Oh yeah, it has worked. So I think I might just do jazz now might but we'll see does anyone else use calgon or or you know similar in their washing machine it's for like lime scale and stuff i've just started using it because it stops your washing machine smelling so it's, it cleans it at the same time anyway better go get this washing sorted out wet dog wet dog where is she had shower because she kept scrapping and she needs a flea treatment don't you you want something do you, do you want a treat? have a little thing <laughs> <laughs> we've uh, managed to get holly's tablet sorted out thank goodness so uh, mark is going to pick them up now so she can have one tonight and hopefully go back to college tomorrow <sighs> i've uh, what have i been doing today oh we watched the start of that um, the Haunting of Blind Manor. It's very good. I'm really enjoying it at the moment. Really enjoying it. So we've watched three episodes so far. And now we're just watching some uh, Zoe and Mark on YouTube. Yeah. Halloween. 
Oh, jeez. Did you, did you want your fingers? No, apparently not. No. Well, I think it would be nice. <laughs> it'd be nice to keep them. Yeah. Holly's donning her dressing gown that she loves. I'll show you like Shane Dawson there in, mm -hmm. a, in his dressing gown. What do you reckon, Eve? Morning. <laughs> oh, what's she doing? It's, um, it's Thursday. And we've come, come this way. If, you, if you're a long-term viewer, you'll, you will have remembered the vlog when it was Mark and my anniversary and we came for a walk. Yeah, she can go on there. Um, to the viaduct, it's pouring rain by the way. We always choose the best times to come out, don't we? <laughs> so yeah, the, this is the, the viaduct walk, if you remember. And uh, Poppy hasn't done it before, I'm just about to see you. Um, but we thought it is pouring now. we'd bring it, yeah, it's actually pouring now, so I better put the camera away for a minute. But oh, I can hear a lot of shouting. Yeah, football's going on. Football. Over. Football in the rain, can't don't beat record. it. Don't record it because it's kids. <laughs> well, what are you doing? Oh, you're getting up there. Oh, it's very echoey. Oh no, Pops, be careful. <laughs> Hitch him up. Ready? <laughs> the climbing days are over. <laughs> well, I mean, you want to try and get up there, it's actually quite oh, I'm shorter than you. Oh, look at that shot through there. Oh, no, that's oh that, that is a cool up. shot. Right, let me have one more go. <laughs> <laughs> that is such a cool shot, no, right. Go on, Pops. Do you want me to push your bum? <laughs> Is there something to grip on? Isn't there? You can't put your foot on the ledge and yeah, push yourself up. Do, but... Oh! <laughs> it's because the, the ledge is actually quite high up. <laughs> it's not going to work, I'm is it? I'm scared that when I go on this, because it's not that flat. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Let me take a, a photo. Oh, that was so close. Do a run up. Go on, Poppy. Go on, girl. Yes. She did it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm going to get down now. <laughs> I've got to take a photo first. Yeah. <laughs> now you've actually oh, done I'm it. Actually kind of hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Do, do a funky pose. <laughs> right, wait there a minute, hang on. Poppy just, from there, she just noticed th this shot, this way. Look at that. Oh, look at the photos from up here. I will do. You're making me feel a bit nervous now. <laughs> You've got a big trickle of water scary. around you. How are you going to get down? I'll sit down and just jump. All right. I might have to pass you my phone again. Poppy's just going to hang out there now. <laughs> So. <laughs> I'll go for the walk and see you in a minute, yeah. right? <laughs> right, there you go. Please pick it up. <laughs> Eve, this way. Oh, there's a dead animal there. Is that a rabbit? Come on in. I had to get through here with me um, scooter when we came before. That's a bit of a tight squeeze. Straight on. No, we're going this way. <laughs> I can tell that by you just jumping let's up on that on thing. No, let's not. Let's not. Get fine. <laughs> Stop raining now, see? That was actually quite scary up there, to be honest. <laughs> you felt like you were going to... You know when you're up on something where you don't have anything supporting you? So yeah. You like you're going to fall off. <laughs> Into the unknown. <laughs> <laughs> Is he having that stream in your back garden? Stream. A stream. Stream. These gardens are like really open. 
What sort of statue is that then? Or garden feature? Like, at, like different garden tools, doesn't it? Strange. It's Very art. strange. Modern art. Strange. No, there's another one in the background. Like, oh yeah. <laughs> Which I mean, if, 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 I, if I had chairs, like right, that's right next to the stream, I would be in there. I'd be toppled in there. <laughs> it's not a very private garden, is it? You couldn't sunbathe topless or anything. I mean, I don't think. <laughs> I mean. I mean. Hey, what you seeing? What you see? Is that where we're going? The field over there. I can't remember, we just follow it round. Us by some sheep. They're all social distancing. They are. Good sheep. <laughs> she coming? You're so short that you cut my head off. I know, sorry. I kept trying to lift the camera up, but it hurts the arm. Next time we come here, I'm going to bring my camera. Yeah, you can take some Look good pictures. Shot. I know, it's good, isn't it? So we're back to the beginning now. Oh. We've, uh, oh, state me. Wash Evie's feet because she's in a mess. I've gone all the way round. I'm shattered now. It's Friday, Friday, Friday. Oh! It's Friday. Let me sit down. Got me posh dress on today. Look at this. Got me posh dress on because um, I'm taking Poppy out for some lunch to Perrywoods. I booked a table because they get booked so quickly. So we're going there in a minute. We're having an early lunch because that's the only one they had, which was half eleven. So I've got five minutes and then we've got to head off. But I just thought I would finish um, with comments of the day. So let's get comments up from oh, the last weekly. I'm going to go first with Barbara Stevens. She says, it's a long, long comment. Don't ever put yourself down. You and your girls are beautiful. I love how you manage to have a chuckle despite being in agony. Always laugh. I find that having a laugh is the best medicine. A good laugh helps to relieve stress, helps your immune system and diminishes your aches and pains. Poor Evie, it's horrid when your pet is ill because they suffer in silence with not being able to say where their pain is. Thanks for the shopping trip. Not being able to go shopping myself, it's a tonic with you showing all the goodies. I thought that jumper you were wearing looked a million dollars on you. Best wishes to you all and let's hope good times are just around the corner. So look forward to watching your vlogs. Thanks for doing them, even when you may not feel like doing them. So I thought that was lovely and I love vlogging if you if you can't tell <laughs> no I love vlogging and I love editing editing I really enjoy as well so it gives me a purpose um, for when I'm not at actual work this is my work and I enjoy it um, I enjoy entertaining you I enjoy bringing you facts and things and tips on fibro and chronic pain so thank you it does i appreciate all your comments i read all your comments i try to reply to all your comments as you probably can tell um if sometimes i get comments pop up and it pops up in my notifications but then i can't find them on the actual thread so i can't reply to them but the ones i do find i, I try to reply to so thank you all your comments are really appreciated Right, okay, Butterfly Love 73 I am so glad everything is going, doing good with Evie. That sweater looks great on you. It was nice to see Poppy more on the video. I'm so happy that you're feeling better. I hope the x-rays go okay. I've got a funny story about the x-rays, I'll quickly tell you. I did think that um, when I was in there, I thought, oh, Mark's going to find this hilarious. Because he's always saying how I'm shrinking and how I'm short. And I was having the x-rays and... Um, before I had them, I had to stand against this thing, the board thing, and she said, oh, no, I'm going to have to lower it down. And then she went, no, I'm going to have to lower it down more. <laughs> and I was just standing there cracking up thinking, Mark is going to find this hilarious because he's always saying that I'm shrinking, which I am shrinking. Everyone shrinks, but I am especially shrinking. Um, so <laughs> either that or everyone's growing taller. <laughs> but 
yeah that was that was quite funny but i had the x-rays done i haven't had the results yet they said a week but when i found the doctors they said three to four weeks so i'm just gonna have to keep trying the doctors every so often to see if they're back but yes, that's the end of this week. I am going to film, because me and Pops, like I say, are going to Periwoods, and I'm going to film the Christmas displays for you for next week's weekly, because this week's too long. These weeklies are getting so long, and I try to condense them as much as possible, but I'm like, I need to leave that in, I need to leave that in. So I apologise if you don't like long vlogs, because my weeklies are long at the moment, but I love long vlogs, so if you're like me, then you're enjoying it. Let me know in the comments below if, if you're all right with my long vlogs. And um, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, and I will see you all on Wednesday for the fibro section. Love you lots. Bye.